I just want to shoot this uh, video uh, because this story recently just came into my head and uh, I'm actually in the middle of running a campaign and um, this story suddenly came into my mind. In fact, it was uh, something that happened, I think, five, six years ago. Um, and I'll share with you this story, um, which is about marketing and getting leads and, and sales. So here we go. Uh, I don't know why am I doing this, but I, did, I thought that I would just want to record this down to really explain. Uh, and I think that it kind of explains the title. How, how bad do you want uh, your leads and, and your sales? So yeah, let's go. So five years ago, I was working in a recruitment firm, HR firm. Um, basically, I am, uh, so I, I, I was a temp, temp staff, temp staff, helping to actually match people, candidates to different, to various uh, job, part-time jobs, you know, like Grab, I, think I remember the time. Um, I was working at Recruit first, uh, previously, you know, after I, I ORD'd from Army. So I was working in, in, in Recruit first, and um, yeah, so very simply, my, my job very simply was just to find candidates online, people who were interested to find jobs, match them. And um, that was basically what I had to do. That was my KPI. If I'm not wrong, I think every month I had to match I, anywhere from maybe 50. I can't exactly remember. I mean, every week I had to hit like around 10, if I'm not wrong. So that was my goal. That was what I had to do. And back then, I wasn't aware of this thing called lead generation. Um, so what I simply had to do was uh, I just get, I, I basically got leads and applicants from my um, manager, my mentor back then. So I think there was this one point in time where I, I couldn't exactly hit the numbers. Um, I, there wasn't enough like people inquiring about finding jobs. I mean, I was posting like simple adverts, but I didn't know they were called ads at the point in time. So, I, yeah, there was this particular point in time where I just like, I couldn't exactly keep my KPI, the lead flow wasn't coming in. Um, and that is when I started getting a little frustrated. I started to post, I started to buy ads on, uh, I think Gumtree and a few other um, job platforms. I can't remember exactly which ones, uh, but the, the lead quality was really, really bad. Um, but so so I think I spent about $100 in ad budget that didn't exactly turn out. I had no leads. Don't know why that happened. But very, very simply, that was the, the, the problem which I faced. Um, so again, I spent, there I was, you know, I spent $100. I had no leads. Um, it was nearing the end of the week and I had no uh, leads for, for, for the next week. Um, I was pretty concerned because uh, I remember, I think a few people were let go because they're going to hit the KPI. So I was kind of worried. So over the weekend, I went to this place called Lot One. Uh, it's actually a pretty busy period. This is pre-COVID, by the way, uh, like five, five, six years ago. Um, I stayed pretty nearby in the West. So I went to this place called Lot One, Chua uh MRT station, uh, because it's a, it had a lot of traffic. So what I did very simply was, um, I, had, I mean, I had to find people who were interested to find jobs, part-time jobs. Um, so I... <laughs> I thought I had a crazy idea. I just had to go down to the place to ask around whether people were looking for jobs. Uh, and it was the weirdest thing I've ever done. Um, and I realized it was pretty crazy. I mean, looking back, it's pretty crazy. Um, I'm looking for leads. I'm going to extend to look for leads. Um, yeah, I, I wanted to lead so bad too. I, 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 I went to the extent of like reaching out to people offline. Uh, when in fact, I think a lot of these, uh, a lot of my colleagues and, and mentors were getting uh, their leads uh, offline and, and, and uh, sorry, online for, for the matter. So um, yeah, I mean, looking back, I, I, I thought I really wanted it. That's, that's why I think I just had to uh, take that big, big move of going to lot one and asking people if they're looking for jobs. Looking back, it sounds so weird. Um, yeah, so how, how was the experience? Very, it was very, 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 very weird. Um, I, <laughs> I remember I approached people <clears throat> who were like, you know, they, I, like, you know, because for those people who actually got off the MRT, they, they exit the, end, the gantry. So I was targeting those people. And uh, some people I asked, some people, you know, they just looked too scary to be to, to approach them. So I think for those that I asked, um, some were friendly, but it, it was really weird because uh, imagine asking people, are you looking for a job? <laughs> and uh, of course, a lot of them gave weird faces, like, what are you trying to do? So 
anyway, so I, I think that was, uh, I mean, looking back, I can see, um, like, I, I, I thought that was pretty interesting uh, experience, which I had, uh, which is more of something like a gun to hit kind of marketing, because if let's say your online ads don't work and you really need like ads, I really, really need like leads ASAP, probably like the next day or next two days, um, I think uh, instead of going on social media, which I think it is definitely a good place, um, but if let's say social media is kind of out of reach or your ad account has been or, or something like that, I think a very, very decent move would be, you know, just going out to the um, MRT where the, where the places have, where the places where there's a lot of traffic and basically ask people if they are interested. So anyway, back to the story, what happened was, um, I, I, I can't remember, I think I got a few leads um, and I think that was pretty funny as well. Uh, but definitely not a very fun experience because of all the weird faces. And, and that, another one was a pretty funny one. Uh, I actually signed up for this, because uh, I, I, I had like issues with getting leads and uh, that was so frustrating if I recall because the KPIs were just so, so hard to hit, at least for me at the point in time. So uh, what I tried, this is my, 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 my second, <laughs> I'll say uh, gun to hit marketing. I actually signed up for a Tinder account um, to actually look for people who were looking for a job. So in my bio, I was like, I'm a HR person. If you're going to look for, for part-time jobs and temp jobs and office jobs and whatnot, uh, hit me up. <laughs> so I thought that was pretty funny. I mean, I, I did get some leads. I, did, I converted a few. So um, yeah, so I, I, I thought that was pretty interesting. So I think the, my, the moral uh, looking back, I thought I'm kind of impressed <laughs> at what I did. Um, but uh yeah, I think it's uh, how bad do you want your leads? How bad do you want success? How, how bad do you want your, your leads to convert? Um, and really, really crucial because I think that um, a lot of times, especially digital marketers, they are too focused on social media ads. Not that it's wrong. I think it's a fantastic way to grow and scale a business. Um, I, I really honestly think that, you know, offline uh, marketing, offline lead generation is also very effective. You just got to find the right way to do it. And um, yeah, I mean, like my belief in lead gen and anything in life, really, it's uh, so long you have, uh, you're going to achieve what you wanted to achieve. I mean, so long you, you can't know what you want to achieve. Um, it's, it's all about the beliefs, like whether do you really believe that you can achieve it? Because I think if you do, then you find the means and ways to, to achieve it. So yeah, that's my little short story about lead generation um, and hence the title, how bad do you want your leads? Um, I think if you really want the leads, I think you go to extents, you go to, you go, you, you go to far, you, you go to, um, I mean, you walk a mile like for, to, to get, to get leads. I think that would be pretty powerful. So yeah, I mean, this is my story on uh, lead generation. <laughs>